Hello YouTube and thanks for tuning in to Spankle Vision. And we're here today in Comedian 23's awesome world. He's got a pretty epic world going on. And he knocked out this super epic space station. What's going on, Comedian? What's going on, man? So yeah, how long did you work on this? Uh, actually, uh, it stretched over a few days, but the structure itself, the space shuttle, I did like, like within a few hours, like five, six hours. Yeah, and whenever he told me he was making this, I didn't even have anything to do with it. I just saw it. I was like, dude, I gotta make a video. It's awesome. He made a little space shuttle over here on the side, and we're gonna go check it all out. I decided to do this video at night, so hopefully it looks good, but that way it fits in with like the space motif. You know, we're out here in space. You can see all the stars. I'll give you a nice fly around of it. He's got some pretty epic stuff going on. I mean, as far as it reminds you of the space station in 2001, a space odyssey. That's what it reminds you of. It's like it had a name I can't remember, but that's what it reminds you of from afar. And like I said, he did detail the inside, so we'll check that out here in a minute. I just want to get a good fly around. We'll get like the down low. You said it looked awesome from the bottom, so yeah. Here we look at that. Oh yeah, it does look cool with the glass down there. Yep. Okay. We should maybe update the top in the future. Put some glass on it. There yeah, it I is. Need more, uh, I need to add more windows, definitely. Yep. Star date twenty one thirty two. The Carillion Nebula. This looks awesome, man. Yeah. So there we are in the deeps of space, folks. So let's go check this thing out on the inside. I'm sure I want to check it out too. I was just in it for a minute there originally. Didn't really look at everything. And we'll check out the shuttle last. We'll go inside there last. Which one you want to go in? Which hatch? I'm coming to you. Uh, I'm up uh, by yeah. the hatch by the space shuttle. Yeah, I'm coming. All right, let's do it. We go in here. So here we go. Got the airlocks. Yep, actually got the airlocks. Like it's a huge well, let's, circle. You want to go around it or go cut across? Yeah, let's go around here and then we'll cut across. So as you can see, I mean, it is it's not like space stations have a lot of space, especially like the International Space Station. This actually looks kind of like some of the conceptual ones for the the the, the space station they want to put up. Like they want to put like a private one up, which that'd be kind of cool. Like space tourism, go up. So yep, it's the same on all four. You got the airlocks on all four sides. I'm gonna cut in, cut it to the across here. I'll get lost in here. Okay, this is that one part with the gray, right? Yeah, this is like the little bunkhouse. Yeah, we're in that little gray, that little gray area. So this is where they'd all bunk. Yeah some little machines I guess servers maybe just something keeping this place yeah, computers monitors stuff like that yeah, the comedian midnight house yeah oh, cool. house helped me with the uh, outer rings of it man look at uh, look at your city down below numbers. it looks cool through here is that the airport over there yep yep okay it's loading in right now This another, yep, yeah, gotta keep crunching some shit. Let's cut across this way. Alright, so yep, yep, you see you got the full X, the bunkhouse. You know, maybe, really, you can't really add any, any other rooms or anything to it. You got it pretty much set up as the only way it could be. I guess if you, I did it, I would have to do it like uh, the bunkhouse. I would have to like yeah. stretch it out or yeah. I could. Well, that looks. It just looks cool the way it is. It's fine. I mean, you're not really missing anything. I mean, they just have to eat over there in their little bunk area too. You know, that's where the most space is. Or go to the shuttle. This is just for living, I'm doing science. Oh yeah. So let's get. Is there an exit on the edges? Uh, yeah, by each of the airlocks, you find a ladder. Right. Like a cool, you got four ways up, that's good. Let's go check out this space shuttle. Looks like we got some guests in here. 
Who are these kids? Nerd Cubed and MG Twist, Edible Drip 7, Mega Holly Chick. One crazy kid. Where are all these people coming from? MG Legends. There's a lot of them in here. <laughs> they got they. Yep, they get to be uh they get to be in a YouTube video. They don't even know it. So here's the shuttle. This thing is bad. I love this. Look at this, folks. Perfect compliment to the hardest part. Yeah, but it looks just like it. It looks like the one they just re or, you know, the one that we used to have at least. They retired it recently. Yeah, it's bad, dude. I like those thrusters. It just looks cool. It looks awesome from the underneath. I like the landing gear, all that, man. It looks great. Should do a tutorial on how to build one of these. This would be a big time hit. People would like this. I like it, man. It's awesome. That's an epic structure in itself. Comedians, uh, space shuttle. You all look at this. That's bad. Tell me that that's not a bad space shuttle. All right, let's get inside. Let's check it out on the inside. I like what you did in there too. And there's another perfect example of using uh, ice as glass. I, th I personally think it looks better. We were just talking about this earlier. Uh, it looks great. Thank you. Whoever opened the door for me. And we're in the shuttle. You got your. I guess you could buckle in here. Here's the main cockpit. Nice comedian way out there. <laughs> Sir, the heat, the heat shields. We lost the heat deflector. We might burn up in the atmosphere when we come back. <laughs> That's what happened to that one. I lost a piece of it. All right. So I guess is this the engine back here, like the engine bay or something? Yeah. Do some. Do some work on it if you had to. Yeah, it's cool. Head out to the main blasters. And I like this. He actually had this is like the airlock. Yep, pull the trigger. It'd be cool if we could get some redstone magic where it opened, you know? Like, but, you know. I don't know if you got enough space. Yeah. Uh, sorry, cramped as it is. I wanted to make it bigger, man, but. No, it's perfect like, size. I to the air, next to the airlock, I actually attach, but like just the layout of the space, like, ship is. Yeah, hard. it wouldn't work, but it looks cool. It's in transit, it's orbiting. Alright, folks. Let me get a good overhead view of this before we count, before we bounce out. And there it is, Comedian 2-3's Epic Space Station. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Stay tuned for more Epic Structures here on Spankle Vision, and take us out, Comedian. Tell them goodbye. Later on, guys and gals.